What is up guys, Hot Pocket 500 here, and today, we will be reviewing this. Nintendo 3DS. So what is the Nintendo 3DS? The Nintendo 3DS is a, is a 2010's Nintendo console. Came out back in 2010. So there were this... <coughs> And for people who already bought it at launch, uh, they got the ad adopter or the ambassador versions. And yeah, it was very great. So today we'll be reviewing this um, this 3DS. So right now there is no game inserted. So let's check what we have first. First we have the system settings, which is very very great I guess you have your uh, data management your um, yeah your your internet your internet um, internet settings Nintendo network settings uh, uh, parental controls and uh, these type of settings as it if you can see the screen closely, I, I don't think if you can, but <clears throat> let's see here. Oh. Alright, so like there's a bit of like RGB lighting in there. Um, it doesn't look like this. It, I mean, it, it like the, the way I'm recording it on my phone camera, it doesn't look like it because it looks very, very different. But if you would see it on my Chromebook camera, then you could see it. But I'm not doing it on my Chromebook because I wanted to record the screen. So we have AR games, Nintendo eShop, 3DS Sound, Mi Plaza, Mi Maker, 3DS Camera, Health and Safety Information, Activity Log, Face Raiders, Download Play, Nothing in the SD Card. And nothing in the game card slot. Plants vs. Zombies for the Nintendo DS. Super Mario Brothers from the Virtual Console. Super Mario Brothers 3 for the Virtual Console. Kirby's Dream Land. And that's it. <clears throat> so, what is. So, what is this? It. Like. So. Not what. What is this? But. Why was this the biggest Nintendo console in 2010's gaming history? Its gimmick feature called the 3D. I can't show it on this footage because this footage isn't a 3DS. <laughs> so, look. As so there's a depth slider over here for the 3D. Oh. There we go. You would turn it on. There you go. You're into a world of 3D. Yeah, it's very, very weird. For my footage, it looks like nothing. It just looks like a normal 2DS. Like a normal 2D screen. But yeah. If you move it around uh, from your eye perspective, it just looks like a blurry mess. I don't know. I can't tell you how much of a blurry mess it is. <clears throat> also, there's some... Uh, a lot of stuff here. So settings, of course, you always gotta have some settings, and you always have to have all this. Also, on here you can uh, this is the home menu settings. So, so this whole thing is your home menu. Those are the settings for it. So for this, you can just change the theme. I have it on blue because blue is my favorite color. Then you have your home menu layout to save it. You have, um, ooh. See here? How do I focus on that? Okay, sc screen brightness. Um, your power saving mode. Nintendo 3DS image share, Amiibo settings, Nintendo eShop, 
uh, system settings. They have like built-in eShop and system settings in the home menu settings. Contact information and that's it. <coughs> I have my stylus here. Uh, let's go get it. So let's see here. I have some pictures here. Let's see here. So yeah, I have a bunch of pictures here. Uh, oh my gosh, I don't like it how they look like from my camera. As you can see, my camera is like very low quality, and if you see it, like, gosh, how do I? Man, that's not how it looks. <clears throat> um. I don't know, but like there's it's just super weird to see that. But anyways, let's uh, get to the actual 3ds. I also have some me's over here <coughs> for from me maker. I had the um, this this 3ds I got from a pawn shop. I didn't get it from Walmart or anything, but yeah. Let's view the me characters. So there's me. There we go. Uh, there's Hot Pocket, my sister, my mom, my dad, my grandpa, my um. Yeah, that was my. That's my uh, my aunt, my cousin, my other cousin. Um. My other cousin too, and my other gra and my grandma. And let's see here, <clears throat> what else do we have? We have a uh, Peter Griffin, this uh, a burger, Sans the skeleton. I don't know why I even made that. Uh, Daco, um, Markiplier, Dan TDM, Logan, <coughs> Logan Thirty Acre. Jacksepticeye, uh, PewDiePie, Luigi, Mario, Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, Foxy, Scott Cawthon, um, Pikachu, um, Donkey Kong, Homer, um, James uh, from the Angry Video Game Nerd, uh, Patter from Peter Netter, or whatever that <coughs> uh, name was. Scott the Waz, Nathaniel Bandy, just a normal, uh, th this is just a normal male me, and this is a normal female me, so yeah, that's, that's basically it. <clears throat> oh my gosh, my, uh, throat's super rashy. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's enough with the, that's enough with the 3DS itself. Let's talk about the games. So the 3DS had this had this super cool feature that it um, not just because of the 3D, but also um, you can uh, you can put in it's backwards compatible compatible with DS games. So it's both a DS and a 3DS. <coughs> so if you would so if you were to go to Super Mario 64 DS. You would click on it, press both start and select while the game is beginning. This is a very fun part about the thing. The pixel perfect mode. It makes it look super crisp. See that is super crisp, not blurry. Although the screen is very small, at least it still works. I mean, I don't care how the screen is. I don't care if it's big or small, it's still a good system. There you go, you can just drag Mario around. Ooh. 
How do I do this? Because it's hard with the touch screen. There we go. Yeah, that's Mario 64 for the DS on pixel perfect mode. If you would do it normally, it would look a little blurry, but I mean, it still works. I mean, it's not it's not that bad. Let's see here. <clears throat> this is how it would look. Way bigger screens. Ooh, okay, that scared me. I thought it was gonna end. So yeah, no 3D works on DS games. It just yeah. And also with this, it's just much more blurry from my perspective. Not only because the 3DS doesn't have the same resolution screens other uh other than uh 3DS games. So for 3DS games, they would look very sharp. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Oh, I gotta tell you about the virtual console games. Virtual console games lets you play older consoles on your newer system. So let's just say I want to play some Super Mario Brothers, like uh, at an airport because I have because um, I don't want to I don't want to wait so much uh, to go to a hotel. So look, here we go, Super Mario Brothers for the Nintendo 3DS. See? Is that easy? Okay, let's see here. Ah, gosh dang it. Alright. So. Jump! There we go. So I don't want to play uh, the NES at a hotel. Or somewhere, so I just play it on my 3DS. And if I want to play it on the go, I can. So yeah, that's very great about the virtual console. And also, if you like, just don't want to bring out a big, huge console with you, just like, like have it all your way and and stuff. Or like even, or even even having uh like so many systems in uh, uh with your TV, and you don't want to like. Take up all the space and even have a fire hazard. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Uh, also hit that notification bell if you want to get notified for for any video that I post. And I will see you guys in the next quarantine video. Bye. Also, it would be.